Hello family, welcome back. If you're new here, welcome. I am Vicki and you're with Grammy in the Kitchen. My husband bought me a new toy. It's the Ninja Power Blender. It's called the Ninja Foodie Power Blender Ultimate System. So it comes with the base, a pitcher, comes with some smaller ones that you can make like smoothies or like something to drink from. And it comes with a grater, a two-part grater where it has the blades and the chute that puts things in it. We're going to use this today to make some delicious homemade hummus. Do you know how easy it is to make hummus? It is just chickpeas. I had some canned chickpeas that I had canned two years ago. But you can use store-bought canned chickpeas or you can buy the dry chickpeas and then cook them according to the package. But you need cooked chickpeas. I have two jars in here and I usually do one jar because I put it in my very small food processor but since we got the new blender we can double this batch so I'm just going to remove the lid and I'm going to tell you right now family these blades are sharp I cut my finger when I was trying to wash this when we first got it so I have two jars of cooked chickpeas that I've drained and rinsed. I'm going to put that in here. I have some tahini. Tahini is just a toasted sesame seed paste. It's pretty much like peanut butter but made with sesame seeds and I'm going to put about two tablespoons and this stuff is pretty thick we'll start with that I have some fresh lemon juice we'll put about a tablespoon that's about good and you can use fresh garlic but I have some frozen garlic pucks the equivalent of each one of these is like two cloves of garlic I'm gonna put two of these pucks in here if you don't like garlic leave it out if you want garlic but not a lot of garlic put less however you want it I'm gonna put some salt And I do like pepper in my hummus, so I'm going to put some pepper and some olive oil. Maybe about two to three tablespoons. We'll start with that. And to get things moving, I'm going to add about a tablespoon of water. I'm going to put the lid on. Snap it closed. I'm going to put it on spread. That's pretty cool. cool. Open the lid. Family, that is so much faster than the food processor. I'm going to give it a little push down. Oh, it's perfectly consistent. Oh my goodness. I love this. Oh, I'm excited. I want to give it a, just a little bit more world. Snap that lid down.
It does have a timer. I haven't figured that part out. And it had it for like 75, and I'm assuming that was 75 seconds. We don't need to do it that long. But I think we're ready. Let's go ahead and check the consistency. Like I said, be very careful with this blade. It is sharp. I think we should taste it before we go any further. Perfect. Now, if you can get some char roasted peppers. You can add that in and make your own roasted pepper hummus. You can put some jalapenos in here. You can do whatever you want. I absolutely love hummus. clean up my mess for a second so I have some store-bought crackers can you see that and so simple it took what five minutes family that is so good So if you're looking for a new blender or a food processor or a combination of the two, I suggest go ahead and get the Ninja Foodie. My husband did pick this up during Amazon Prime, so he got it at a discount. I think it was $2.39 for everything in that box. And I think he paid $149, so it's about $90 off. So worth it. If you don't mind, give this video a thumbs up while you're at it. Please subscribe. I would love to have you part of the Gravy family. Until next time, y'all have a blessed day. Bye, family.